LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys. Notice, many times, laptop manufacturers produce keyboards that look the same on the outside, but have different retainer clips underneath the keys. To help you find the correct repair video for your keyboard, we've created a searchable database. Simply go to LaptopKey.com, enter your laptop brand and model number. Scroll down to the bottom of the page and click on View Videos. A list of all compatible videos will appear. Select the retainer clip model that matches your keyboard. That's all. You're now ready to repair your laptop keyboard. For this keyboard, we will be showing the removal and reattachment of the J key for standard size keys, Shift for the wide set keys, and F12 for the top row small keys. To remove your standard size keys, insert a tool under the upper right corner, apply gentle upward pressure to both sides, and the keycap will be removed. To remove the retainer clips, support the bottom of the clip with your finger, insert a tool under the upper right corner, apply gentle upward pressure, repeat with the upper left corner, and the clip will be removed. To reassemble your clips, we'll begin with the top clip, which has two thin holes and a flattened edge at the bottom. And for the bottom clip, there are two a divots and an upward facing notch at the top. To connect the two halves, lay them together, small presses ensuring the plastic support arms on the top clip enter the holes on the bottom. Then using metal hooks here, 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 and here, we will lay the clip down bottom first Pressing slightly on the upper corners, replace the keycap with a firm press, and we are functional. To remove your wide set keys, insert a tool under the upper right corner, gentle upward pressure around either corner, go around the edge to disconnect from the metal support arms. And the keycap is removed. To remove the metal support arms, simply lift, push one end to the side, repeat with the other end, and it is removed. Repeat with the opposite arm, push, push, and it's out. To remove the retainer clips, support the bottom of the clip with your finger, insert your tool under the side, and run upwards under the corners until the clip is removed. To reassemble your clips, We'll begin with the top clip, which has two holes at the bottom and two support arms at the top. For the bottom clip, there are two holes and a divot at the top. Connect the two halves together by lining them up, pressing firmly to insert the arms from the top into the holes of the bottom. Then using metal hooks here, 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 and here, we will place the clip down bottom first Hook at the bottom, press on the two top corners, replace the metal arms using holes here, 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 and here, using the top set of holes for the top clip, inserting and laying flat, and repeating with the bottom Flat. Then take your keycap, place on top of everything with a firm press, all the edges in the center, and we're functional. To remove the top row keys, insert your tool under the upper right corner, apply gentle upward pressure, repeat from the bottom if necessary, and the key will be removed. To remove the retainer clips, support the bottom of the clip with your finger, insert your tool under the side, Apply gentle upward pressure to the top right and left corners and the clip is removed. To reassemble your clips, we'll begin with the top clip which has two holes at the top and two support arms at the bottom. For the bottom clip, there is an opening and two holes at the bottom. Connect the two halves together, 
making sure the support arms from the top go into the holes on the bottom. You need to give a slight push to the side to get everything together. Then using metal hooks here, 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 and here, we will lay the clip down bottom first on those bottom hooks, press on the corners, replace our key cap with a firm press, and we're functional. We'll now show you how to remove a laptop key. Simply pull on the edge of the key in a gentle but firm motion. Lift up and remove the key. It's that simple. If your key is loose and not sticking properly to your keyboard, your retainer clips are likely broken. This issue can be fixed by replacing your retainer clips. Replacement laptop keys and retainer clips can be purchased at LaptopKey.com. LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys.